Well, thank you, Mr. Speaker. I just want to take a, t a moment to recognize the great work that's going on back home in Memphis in District 90. Um, Choices Memphis um, opened up about a few months ago. Their new state-of-the-art uh, facility and on reproductive health. And so about a couple weeks ago, they got approved for birthing and on yesterday had their very first birth. And so I want to say congratulations to the staff um, as well as the mother and the father of the beautiful baby girl. Good morning, y'all. So it is 6:30 a.m. February 7th, and I am having major contractions. I've been having contractions since 12 o'clock. So I know we haven't been recording a lot, but I will be giving birth at a birthing center. So we're here there now. Yeah, the car is packed up. Everything is ready. And so when we get there, we'll show y'all around and whew, get this show on the road. It's time to meet baby girl. <laughs> So we at the birthday center, y'all, and uh, man, I ain't gonna lie, my anxiety through the roof right now. So we're having our daughter at a birthing center, um, as y'all probably have seen on one of our other videos. And um, I have to get my breath together because I had to run upstairs and all kind of stuff, man. My, like I told y'all, I'm, I'm pregnant brain is crazy right now. I can't even think really, I'm just really just rambling. But anyway, uh, we the first people to actually um, give birth in this birthday center so um i just i can't believe it like d she been up all night having contraction but they were slow and i think i woke up like probably about maybe like 3 30 4 o'clock and i was you know i seen her she up and i see her doing like the little time on her phone as far as like the little contraction in between and, and they kept like kind of coming i'm like hey you might want to hit somebody up because like these seem like they're a little bit too close and she was like, you know, if anybody know D, like, she, like, pain, stuff like that, she just take it. And, um, she went to the bathroom, and next thing I know, she, um, she came back probably about 15, 20 minutes later. She like, all right, we need to go and get up and go. By this time, it's like 5 o'clock, so I jump up. Like, I, it's like I wouldn't even sleep. I barely would sleep anyway. I ain't got no sleep this whole week, but, um, yeah, we here. So I'm gonna try to give y'all like a little tour. So this is our room right here. I'm gonna take y'all there in a second, but on the outside they are the rooms that got like this little patio space. And you know, if it was actually summertime, it'll probably be a lot better to be out here. Sun will be out, but it's cold as a mug. So we may not spend too much time out here, but you got your chairs and stuff, benches. So it's a pretty cool little spot right here. You got this big tub. Huge, like I need one of these for the crib. You can sit down in the junk and then still have plenty of space. Um, so you got that as a heating pad, got your sink and everything up here. Uh, cleaning supplies, cabinets, all that. I ain't gonna go through all that because I don't know what's in there, but I'm sure. Matter of fact, might as well open it. Yeah. Doctor stuff, nurse stuff. Um, right here. I can't open it. I don't know why. I just had it open. 
But again, I'm not finna break nothing, so I'm gonna leave that alone. But it opened all the way up. Um, this right here, I believe is the little stretching thing. So y'all let me know if I'm wrong, but I believe so. Oof, and then you got this bed right here, which is where, you know, we'll be chilling. So we'll actually be here, I think it says six hours after the birth. So let's say she coming in the next two hours after that. We'll be here another six hours and make sure everything is straight. Then we'll go home and then actually come back and check on us at the house, I believe, in a few days after that. So, um, this is the room, like I said, for the most part. Uh, I'm gonna put my mask on and kind of give y'all a little tour of the, of the outside if I can. Up here, actually play music so she can hook her music up to the Bluetooth speaker. I had the music playing while we in here. How you doing, mama? <laughs> Okay, talk. <laughs> All right, you want me to pack this up? Uh, my you get it. Yeah. What you need? No. Okay. Okay. All right, well, I'm gonna be right back, okay? Was I supposed to tell them that you ready or whatever? Uh, I mean, you don't it. Yeah, okay. She out. Might well get y'all on camera real quick. Okay. So this is the birthday right here. Everybody, y'all want to introduce yourself? Okay. So I'm we, Brooke. Okay. I'm Talita. Okay. I'm Kamitra. All right. Terry. And then who they back there? Lex. 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 She back there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so that go, this is our team, y'all. That you know gonna be helping us get everything together. So appreciate y'all. Yay! Yeah. On Super Bowl yeah. Sunday. Super Bowl Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> but um. I'm gonna show y'all the suite real quick. So, if you had a little bit more family out here, you see this just a little waiting area, the big TV. So, with the Super Bowl being today, this is probably where I would be at once, the, once she get here. Hopefully everything's good. I'll be right here just careful watching TV. But you got your seating area here, kitchen, uh, fridge, and all of that. And then it's all their offices, so I ain't gonna check over here. My, my business, but uh, that's pretty much it. So I just wanna give y'all a real quick tour. And I'm um, gonna get back in this room and check on these. So we're at the birth center, obviously. I'm pretty sure y'all seen that. I am dilated to six. Um, water still haven't broken yet. Just sitting on the toilet. Ain't no baby girl to come on down. I'm excited. You excited? Yeah. Look at how I like this Subo Sunday down. Hopefully it don't doesn't slow down. Everything is going good. So she's swinging for baby girl. I'm excited. I'm pretty sure uh, Chris gave y'all the um, birthday center tour. Yep. Um, showed y'all the midwives and the doula. We're doing good. Thank God. Thank yep. God. So we're probably about to say a prayer and just relax on the toilet. And we'll talk to y'all. Give y'all an update a little bit later.
What y'all think? Should we, should we go and break the wall or we'll let it go? What y'all think? Put it in the comment right now. It's not that I What's your last thought before we do this? You got no thought. I'm trying to keep myself calm. Yeah. I need you next to me. I got you. Bring your house down. Oh, 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 you sure? Do you want to get in this? Don't. Okay. Relax. Relax. You got it, Christian. It actually broke on its own. Oh. Yeah, mama. Okay, 780. Oh, same rope trip plus one rope trip. And she rubbed it on her arm. Yeah, I, I just put the tip in and I didn't even get it. So, we're going to be true. I know. I got fingers that are high on HEL. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. She said, come closer to her. Yeah, they can call me. I got those fingers. Yeah, baby. Oh, Lord. I 
make it, just kind of shutting your legs down so you want to get those fast and slow motion. All right, so five like this, and then flip to five. Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. You want that?
Shoulders, knees, and toes, girl. It's my favorite line to say. <laughs> Can you give me a little push? Too. What? It's it fast. It did. It did. Give me a little push, Deidre. I feel like I'm first, baby. You just had a whole baby. It was on y'all parents, man. It was all on candy. You are daddy. Use the pappy. Oh. Yeah. Mine count down from 10. Okay, y'all ready? Mine's counting down too. Okay, we're getting this up. 